What's going on guys? It is your boy Mars and today we are tuning back 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 again making some more tuning videos for you guys. As you guys can see in my background I have an amazing car, a legendary car, a really lightweight car and uh it's probably not even legal for the uh quarter mile scene for the the drag racing scene for the street scene as I call it. Um, so let's 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 get right to it. Let's get right to it. Let me show you guys what is the car. It is this right here, 1977 Holden Tirana A9X. Uh, it's an amazing car, extremely lightweight, extremely fast in the uh, the last uh, Horizon, and uh, I remade it back here on four as a seven. Uh, so let's get right to it. Let me show you guys the tune. I bought the car. I already got it made. Uh, let's go to the upgrade shot. Of course, we're going to go all the way to the conversions. We're going to go here and put the uh, 6.2 liter V8 motor in it. Uh, after that, of course, the car is going to be rear wheel drive. Then we're going to go uh, put the twin turbos into the car. Then we're going to back out all the way and go to the engine and pretty much put everything on here. Race. As you guys can see, that's race. Race right there race right there so yeah just put everything race from these uh cams to the valves we got the engine block on there there we go let's put everything on there race got the twin turbos on there there we go the inner cooler and with the uh we left the oil and cooling we left that stock uh the car is really light doesn't even need that much horsepower we already have it at 1055 so it's uh, already pristine. Uh, after that, with the uh, flywheel, we left that alone. We're going to leave the flywheel stock. And then let's go here. Let's put everything on here. Race. Like the rally suspension. Rally suspension, you hear me? <laughs> the race suspension. And we're going to put everything here. Race. And, of course, got a roll cage. And, of course, rate reducted. So the car is sitting at 2,200 pounds. Just 2,200 pounds. That is insanely light. Um, so let's go right here. Put everything else. Race. I like that. Just as so as you guys can see. Just like that. And then we're going to go to the tires. Of course, we're going to put the uh, race tires. Uh, with the uh, the front tire width, we're going to leave it alone at the 195s. And then the rear, we're going to put it all the way as wide as we can at the 335s, which that's really good for this car. Uh, it's a really small car, but yet you can put these really, really wide um, wheels on it. Now, the rims that I put were these where are you? right here. They were these F1 Speedline wheels. Love these wheels. They look amazing on the cars. Uh, with the size of the wheel, left it alone in 14 in the front and 14 in the rear now with the uh front bumper they didn't do i did put the other uh, holding front bumper which kind of eliminated a little bit of weight uh didn't do nothing with the spoiler i did do the uh hold in the rear and i did put a hood on there so i gave it the most uh you know take out as much weight as i can besides that we left that alone and that's pretty much the build of the car now let's go to the tune guys uh, real quick, we're going to go and put 55 in the front tire pressure. Then we got it at 26.5 in the rear. Then we got a 310 on that final drive. First gear is at 218. Second gear is at 150. Third gear is at 115. And fourth gear is at 1. I'm uh, pretty sure this car is going to be three gears, but if it is a four gear, there it goes. One. Uh, then we have uh, some positive camber on there. Less po more positive camber. The, the some of the cars like a lot of positive camber due to the fact that uh, less tire print on the ground, which uh, you know it's a lot better. You can see the your uh, zero to sixty, zero to hundred change as well when you do this. That's how you know that it's actually working. Some of the cars you don't even need to do anything with the uh, positive or negative on the camber on the front. On the rear, it's going to be zero, and everything else is going to be zero, and then we have it at seven. With the uh, front caster, then we have uh, 40 and 40, uh, anti-roll bars, uh, really soft in the front at 118, pretty stiff, kind of in the middle at 533. Then I have it all the way raised, front and rear, 9.6 and 8.8. .8. Then uh, we have it at soft, stiff again at 2.5, 13, 2.5, and 13. 
nothing with that nothing with that and then 100 and 100 that's pretty much it guys it's going to be the tune of the car and the build of the car let's go and free play real quick so i can go to the street show you guys a nice little pass with this vehicle and then uh, we'll be done we'll be done hope you guys like this car this car is an amazing car i love this car from even the motorsport 6 it was a really really fast 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 car every time people would bring it out it was like ah oh, come on really because it was so light and um let's see let me pick my track real quick and let's go like that and yep let's start it up so yeah i did this nice little paint scheme got it carbon fiber all the way in the whole front end is carbon fiber but then i made the um the flares the fender flares i made them regular so it gave you like a nice little twist of carbon fiber with regular fender flares like it was pretty cool Alrighty, let's go here let's go to test So you'll have to go one over to set up, go down to test drive, and then it'll start the race. Got the LS motor in it. Sounds amazing. Look at those front calipers get red front rotors and all that alrighty so we're gonna line up around here it's real simple guys just line up like that you're gonna press down the e-brake which is a and then you're going to feather the gas with the RT button until the car holds right there at almost 2,000 rpms and all you gotta do is just let go of the e-brake and then you're gonna uh, press the clutch to transition to second and third You saw that that whole time right there it was like a in between between spinning and gripping like that there is no way of making this gear even even shorter i have this car pretty pretty tuned uh right pretty pristine extremely fast i uh, hope you guys love the tune um after that let me show you guys my assist as you guys can see everything is pretty much turned off got the car manual with clutch um and cosmetic and that's pretty much steering is going to be normal that's how you're going to have the whole settings uh you want your car to be with no assist pretty much and that's how you'll get the car to be as fast uh, as possible i hope you guys like the tune hope you guys enjoy it hope you guys be destroying other guys on the uh the street with this car it is a fast car and i love car i love this car and uh see you guys around with another tuning video peace out guys